It's time to use your supreme veto power save to announce the two housemates you have decided to save. Uh, what's up, man? Uh, um, I don't have much to say. I know you're not going to pick me, so it's not a big deal. But we don't have issues. We are not fighting. I just... Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Tonight's nomination process and of course head of house game was a very crazy one, right? Congratulations to Chi Chi, who emerged to the head of house and she took Fina and Daniela straight into the finals alongside with her. You need to follow me to the end of this video to understand what happened tonight. How did these all start? People that called them into the arena and of course welcomed them into the penultimate and of course the very important head of house challenge, okay? And the people that told them there is only going to be one game. Now, this game is a game of seesaw beams, right? But the first thing Big Brother did was to tell Fina, the head of house, as usual, that her weekly reign as head of house has come to an end, and of course, she cannot participate in head of house challenge. Your tenure as head of house has come to an end. Yes, Big Brother. He also went ahead to tell Rachel as Rachel, of course, who was the tail of house last week, is done with the punishment for as a tail of house. And of course, she should better put in more work into this week so that she doesn't repeat being the tail of house. So what are these housemates supposed to do? They're supposed to pick five plastic balls from one end, balance themselves on the beam, and of course, drop the ball in the small whatever that's at the other end, and go back to the other side on the beam. So in the space of going in and out of that, make sure that your balls remain inside that space. Just so that the housemates could really understand what Big Brother was talking about, right? He told a ninja, Ninja 3, to demonstrate what he meant into detail, telling them how they should play the game. And straight up after the sound of the buzzer, the game began. Now, just so you know, this week's nomination is the final nominations we're going to have for the week, right? Because it came on screen and told us all of that. And now while the game was going on, people's balls started falling out. We saw Hermes' ball, he had put three in and trying to go to the other place, you know, three balls bounced out. And then we saw Chi Chi, before we said Jack, Chi Chi already had four balls in, right? And then she took the fifth ball and she carefully went to the other end, dropped the ball in there where the four balls were and carefully went back to the other side. And guess what? As soon as she was going back and she balanced, every other answer saying, you know what? Chi Chi has won. And then Big Brother announced Chi Chi as the supreme head of the house for this season. Automatically, Chi Chi made her way straight into the grand finale coming up on the 2nd of October, right? And of course, Big Brother told her she has all the head of house privileges. And of course, she should choose a companion for this week. And then she chose Cheesy. Head of house Chi Chi. Yes, Big Brother. Congratulations. Thank you, Big Brother. Of course, Big Brother told Cheesy that he has unlimited access into the head of house room, but of course he has no immunity, right? So he will most likely be up for evictions, according to Big Brother. And then he called Daniela and told Daniela that, you know what? You are the tail of the house. I'm going to announce your punishment later. Then Big Brother told the housemate that, you know, tonight's nomination will take a different time. It's going to happen in the lounge. And what's going to happen? You guys, one after the other, will stand in front of the head of house, Chi Chi, and you will pitch to her, right? 
According to what Big Brother said, you pitch to her why you should be one of the two persons she's going to take with herself into the final. So one after the other, you have 90 seconds to pitch to her. If she deems you fit, you know, to be in the final, she'll choose you. And after the 90 seconds, right, the two people she chooses will go with her into the finals. Now, this automatically means that the remaining of the housemates will be up for evictions, right? And then Big Brother asks them to leave the arena. And then we saw Chichi and, of course, Fina leave the arena, hugging themselves and all of that. Literally, you could see that the bond between these two people kind of going stronger. And then we saw the housemates gathered in the garden, right? And, of course, what were they told? Big Brother told them, you know what? You were given 20 minutes to prepare your pitch, right? To pitch to the head of the house, the supreme head of the house, Chichi, telling her why she should take you. She should choose you to go straight into the grand finale. And the big brother told them that one after the other, right? Nobody will be in the lounge. It's just going to be the head of the house and the contestant or the housemate who will stay in front of Chichi and tell Chichi why Chichi should choose them as one of the housemates going into the finals. And of course, we started with Groovy. And of course, Groovy gave his points why you know Chichi should choose him. Uh, head of house, uh, house Chichi. You know, you know what you know is if you sleep on the fair, a snowball. Go guys again or we need um, the head of the house. Um, I want you to pick me as one of the housemates to be on the finale because um, because I want to share the stage with you. Because now a few pitches that stood out for me were like three, right? I want to start up with Cheesy. Cheesy already was chosen by, you know, Chi Chi to be a companion for with her in the head of house room. And when he came, he told, you know, he told Chi Chi that see, we know it's only one slot because automatically he already feels like Fina. Right, it has already been chosen by Chichi. Looking at the fact that you know, if Chichi last week and swapped up for, with Allison, so Chichi comes here saying, You know what? I know it's just one slot left, right? So that one slot, try to pick me. I want to start, I want to start by saying, saying thank you very much for picking me. I know there are so many, so much guys, so many guys before me that you've met before me, but that's a spot maybe you saw with me as a stunt leader. I don't know, and you picked me. Whatever I'm saying is that. I know there is only one slot left. Sure. Of course, we saw Adekule's speech, and of course, we saw Shex's speech, right? And another speech that was really, really weird and crazy was the Rachel speech, right? The picture of Rachel was crazy. She walked in there and she said, hey, what's about Alpha? Whatever she was saying, right? Saying that, see, I know that you're not going to choose me. So let me first clear you, right? I know there's where I feel about you and it's not going to change, right? I need you to own up to your SHIT, right? I want you to change your mindset. I need you to own up to whatever you have done wrong anytime it's been put to you. And, you know, Chichi was like, is that what you came here to do? She was like, yeah, that's what I came here to do. I'm just going to tell you, own up to your wrong whenever you're wrong. And it was an awkward moment. <laughs> Uh, what's up, man? Uh, oh, hi. Um, I don't have much to say. I know you're not going to pick me, so it's not a big deal. But we don't have issues. We are not fighting. I just feel a particular way, and I still feel that way. I just feel like sometimes you should own up to your shit. That's how I feel. But is this how you want to say I'm this? sure, obviously, we are cool. And then, of course, we saw Fina's speech. Looking at the fact that, you know, Fina and, of course, um, you know, Chichi are like very good friends, right? So Fina got their first healing Chichi, right? They're friends. They literally heal each other, right? But eventually Fina was like, please choose me from your good heart. Please choose me. The streets made a queen bro! And then I say, ooh, hey! The last two will be where they like this before. It's not exciting. And then of course we saw Bella and of course Daniela pitched the last, right? And Daniela's speech was more of, you know, I'm happy for you. And of course, and she gave valid points that she wants to be on the final stage. That guess what? That, that Chichi should choose her. I think the two serious speeches that I saw were Groovy's speech and of course, Daniela's speech. And the people that called Chichi into the lounge. Straight up, he asked her, what was your experience like during the pitch? And Chichi was like, see, some people came in there on serious. They came in there thinking that oh, it's just Chichi. I mean. And of course, she was looking at the fact that some came in there, they were not taking it seriously, while some took it seriously. And then Big Brother asked her, who are the two people you like to save? And she mentioned Fina and Daniela. Please pick the two housemates you have decided to use your supreme veto power to save now. Okay. Daniela and Fina. And then straight up, we saw the housemates in the lounge, right? Big Brother told Chi Chi to stand up and tell everyone, in the presence of everyone, the two people she has decided to save. And of course, she mentioned Daniela and Fina. Daniela and Fina. Oh. Thank you, Daniela. 
Athena. And then we saw Daniela in tears because literally she probably would have believed it in her wildest imagination that she would be in the grand finale, that Chichi would even choose her out of the many other pitches that the housemates you know, pitched to her. And that was it. So we have eight housemates who are up for this for eviction this week. The eight housemates are up for eviction are Dekule, Shex, Bella, and the remaining housemates are up for eviction. But always remember that Rachel and first Chichi are riders. And there's nothing you can do at the moment to take them out of the house. So, ladies and gentlemen, go to the comment section. Let me know what you first think about Chichi winning the head of the house, right? And what do you think about the people she saved, Fina, and of course, Daniela. Go to the comment section and let me know what you think. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Please, if you have not subscribed to my channel, so hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, and guys, so you're notified whenever I post a video. We're on all social media platforms on Facebook, on Instagram, on Twitter, and of course, on TikTok. And follow me at the Femi Daniel. Until next time, I come away again very soon. That's bye for now.